Hey guys, what's up? TTM Mike here, coming at you with a new video. Uh, I haven't made a video in a few days, but uh, I'm here with a with a goodie today. And uh, yesterday was Sunday, Mother's Day. Hope if there are any mothers out there watching, uh, the, sh the mothers out there had a good Mother's Day. Uh, love mothers, mother f uh, stepmothers, and uh, mother figures. Very important in this world. So, let's get to the mail. Got some uh, fan packs in. This one's coming in from the Rays. Rays, send me a fan pack. Well, all right. So, first fan pack they sent me this mini pennant. Raise up. They sent me like a window cling. Raise up. They sent me this schedule right here. Uh, who is that? Is that Wanda? Is that Wanda Franco? I'm not sure. If you know, let me know. It looks like him. Wanda Franco looking like schedule. They sent me this little Tampa Bay. Welcome to Tampa Bay. This would be cool for an autograph right here. Blank on the back. They sent me this another raise up. Uh, this is like a refrigerator magnet. Raise up. They sent me a Kevin Kiermeyer postcard, black and white. And they sent me the Tampa Bay Rays mascot, Raymond, Raymond the mascot, Rays win. So thank you to the Tampa Bay Rays. Got another fan pack here. This one's coming from... The White Sox. Let's see what the White Sox sent me. They sent me a couple of things here. First off, they sent me a pack of cards. Always cool to receive free cards in the mail. So they sent me some cards. They sent me a... Who is this? This is Lucas Giolito. So they sent me a Lucas Giolito postcard. Change the game. Very cool. They sent me a, a letter thanking me for being a fan. They sent me a White Sox schedule. 2022 Chicago White Sox schedule. And that is that. And we have fan pack number three. It's coming back from the Orlando Magic basketball team. They sent me a couple of things as well. They sent me number one. They sent me a mask. Loyal Blue Orlando Magic season ticket holder. So they gave out some mask at the game, I'm assuming. Pretty cool. They said, I don't know what the heck this is. If anybody knows what this is, it's like a little pouch of some kind. Is it a change holder? I don't know what it is. Looks like it has an ad adhesive on the back. So, I don't know. You stick it on your dashboard, maybe? I don't know what that is. They, they also sent me a stick, a magnet for the fridge. Orlando Magic Magnet. They sent me a little Magic Fan on board magnet. Yes, you stick that onto your car. Little Magic Fan on board. And they send me a thank you for your support. Go Magic. So thank you very much to the Orlando Magic Organization for hooking it up with a fan pack. Haven't received. Oh, the Rays also sent me a pen, pencil. Uh, haven't received many fan packs back lately, but uh, happy to receive those. Now on to some TTMs I received. Shout out to Tony Black, the Notre Dame Irish fan. I received this card back from former Notre Dame linebacker. Also, he was a former Jet. Bob Crable, he inscribed in Notre Dame, number 43, two-time All-American. And then he also signed 
my Jets card. Bob Crable, New York Jets, 82 to 87, number 50. He retired because he sustained a knee injury, but he was a pretty good inside linebacker. Then I got a return from the great Hall of Fame coach, the women's UConn coach, Gino Oriema. Send this out to the uh, UConn, to the school. Thank you, Mr. Oriema. And then I send this one out to uh, Pepper Johnson. Pepper Johnson was a linebacker on the Giants, uh, late 80s, early 90s. Prom with Pepper, man, he was, uh, he came up when we had Lawrence Taylor, Carl Banks, so uh, he went unnoticed pretty much, but he was pretty good. And he went on to uh, the Cleveland Browns, and uh, he retired. Uh, he was the he's the Super Bowl winner for us. Pepper Johnson, great player. So he signed two of two for five dollars each. He has a sign fee, Pepper Johnson. So thank you very much, Mr. Pepper Johnson. And then he sent me this thing right here. I guess he's a what is he a Buckeye? Yeah, uh, I guess it's an advertisement for he does cameo appearances. Cameo Pep J52 for all occasions, birthdays, anniversaries, Christmas, divorce. Um, he does a he does a cameo. He probably charges. There's a, there's a fee for his uh, cameo appearance. That's a, like a video, like a Zoom video type thing. So won't be doing that. But thanks anyway. Then I received a hockey return, one of one, from Mr. Gary Dornhofer. Mr. Gary Donhofer was part of the uh, great Philadelphia Flyers teams of the 70s who, that won back-to-back -back Stanley Cup champions in 74-75. So, Gary Donhofer, thank you, kind sir. Then I received this one back. It says, Mike, and I can't make that middle stuff out, but this is coming back from former Charlie's Angel, Jacqueline Smith. She signed two of two for me. Funny thing about Miss Smith, when you write her a letter, if you're requesting an autograph return from her, she wants you to stay in the letter. Could you please personalize, add my, uh, add my name to the request? If you don't, if you don't mention that in the letter, uh, asking her to please personalize it to you, she will not sign. Don't know why that is, but a little quirky, but I appreciate it. I put it down in my letter. Could you please sign my cards to Mike? So this one says, Mike, all good wishes, Jacqueline Smith. Thank you, Miss Jacqueline Smith. Very pretty lady. Starred in, she was one of the original three Charlie's Angels. And then last but not least, TTM Returns. I got former Mets radio announcer. He used to announce games with the great Bob Murphy. This is Mr. Gary Thorne. I think he wrote down a biblical inscription there, 522. I don't understand. I don't know what that is. But uh, I don't know. Five something. But uh, Mr. Gary Thorne sent me this one. And then he was also an announcer. When he left the Mets, he went to the Baltimore Orioles and he became their TV announcer. And when the Baltimore Orioles would win games, he'd sign off saying, I do, I do. And when they lost, he'd just say, I do. So thank you, Mr. Gary Thorne. Mr. Gary Thorne included this card here. That's him right there, Gary Thorne. He said, Mike, thanks for the kind note. GT, Gary Thorne. Flip it around. Baltimore Orioles, Gary Thorn. So, very cool return. Thank you, Mr. Gary Thorn, for throwing one in there. Now, I'll get on real quick to my uh, eBay pickups. So, I picked this up. This is the first on field female coach for the San Francisco Giants. There's Alyssa Nakin. I picked up two of them. I'll keep one and I'm going to send the other one through the mail, see if she'll sign it for me. Then, I received this Dunruss. Uh, Diamond Kings of my man, you guys know, I PC Jake DeGrom, so I added this to the PC, and I also picked up this sweet looking Marvels card, and this is numbered 773 of 99, 
It's really, really shiny. Beautiful card. Love it. Jacob the Grom. And then I picked up this uh, Topps Archive Snapshots. Sweet little Jacob the Grom card. I think this was from 2021. Oh, 2019. But I did not have that in my collection. So happy to add this one to the Jake the Groms PC. So that is it, guys. That's all I have. I took the week off. And I'll probably just continue doing one video a week. Uh, the TTM's come in very slowly. They've been coming in slow. And fan packs have been non-existent. And all of a sudden, I got three in one week. So very happy for that. And, uh, yeah, making my pickups on eBay, continuing to add to my Jacob the Grom PC, my Molina PC, and once in a while, if I see a good trout, I pick up a trout. So, I also picked this one up, but this was a while ago. I'm just sending it out to SGC soon. It is a Casey Stengel patch card. I did not pay $20 for this card. I just I just put it in this holder. I forgot what I what was worth twenty, but I did not pay twenty dollars for this card. But nonetheless, it is a is this a game worn jersey patch was retired by the New York Yankees. What does that say? Just Casey Stengel. What's the back say? Congratulations. You have just received an authentic game worn uniform card of Casey Stengel. So, not a Yankee fan, but I respect the Yankees and everything they've accomplished. That's why I collect their autographs through the mail. And uh, happy to add this Casey Stengel. He was also the original manager of the New York Mets. Casey Stengel. He was quite the character. So, happy to add him to my PC. Piece of uniform right there. Pretty cool. Game one. So that is it, guys. Thanks for joining in. Please hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. If this is your first time here, please subscribe. Love doing these videos. And I have a, a flea market video coming up. I'll do that later on during the week. Maybe I'll just do it next week. I'm not sure. I went to the flea market this past week or last week. And I hadn't been to the flea market in quite some time. And I picked up a few items. So I'll share that with you in another video. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Please hit that like button, subscribe, and I will catch you guys next time. Take care, everybody. God bless. Peace. Hope you had a good Mother's Day.